try to deliver value and try to deliver value on uh, entrepreneurs. And I mean, who's watching right now, who's an entrepreneur, he knows the game, you know, even a coach is an entrepreneur, even a trainer is an entrepreneur, yeah. even an expert, it's an entrepreneurial game, okay? It's nothing to do with artists. So anyway, this was not in my plan to be a businessman, to be an entrepreneur and to know about marketing, to know about sales, you know, and uh, this situa situation was really overwhelming for me. This is my situation. Like, <laughs> was... Amazing to see that. <laughs> uh, the transformation. Exactly. Try to deliver value, but I was I was constantly distracted from technology, from social media, what other people were doing, and comparing my life with them. It was a horrible time, really, my worst time. And I don't get productive, and I this all of this new stuff was so overwhelming for me that I was constantly distracted. So, and this was going so far. That I was one day in a car, I was distract distracted just for one second from a message. And this happened. Wow. I had a car accident. And this was really a horrible time. I really risked my life because I was distracted from technology. This was crazy. I really risked my life. So four days later after this car accident, I had really physical pain. I was sitting on the couch and a friend of mine sent me a quote from Jim Rohn, who knows Jim Rohn watching right now. Yeah. And on the school was written, to have more than you've got, you have to become more than you are. Yeah. So I really recognize this was my fault. This was my responsibility. Why I come dead down and why I fall down and why I had this car accident, why I was constantly distracted was because of me. I was responsible for it. So I said, okay, for or you stay down and it gets even more worse or you stand up and you learn all the tools you know and this was really like i turned my biggest most worst experience my biggest opportunity okay mm -hmm. and this is what happened i get so motivated i really stood up and constantly learning new things every day you know, every week now, today, I'm in a, in, a, in, a, in a drive right now and in the motivation where I constantly read every week a new book. And uh, this was really, it was really mind-blowing for me because I get in a mood, in a, in a motion of learning constantly new things. And this was really uh, a, a, a new world for me that I open. You know, I learn about entrepreneurship. I learn about futurism. I learn about marketing, about sales, and all the other stuff. So imagine, you know, I'm here as an artist, and all of a sudden, I'm a constant learner. It was a huge uh, game changer for me. So, and I try to get strategies down, try to put some stuff some realization for me, why I did the accident and what is the next level for me. I was constantly working on myself. And like, this, this was like, this is how I felt. And, you know, I felt like I- In a blind spot. Yeah, found some, I really, a lot of discoveries about myself, about the world, about the business, about marketing, about sales, how the world works. I was constantly discovering new things. And then I also, after thousands of paper that I, <laughs> it's bad for the nature, I know, but uh, I use thousands of papers, writing down things, strategies, etc. Then I come up with this. And this is a hero's journey in a simplified way, you know. And I think when everybody using this framework, this strategy, I think we can make the world a better place. We can go out and we will have a different kind of identity, you know. This is what I put together. Leadership, everything I'm... starts from leadership. Exactly. And we need to be a guide for the people, for our clients, okay. The client is, is on a journey. And on this journey, he, he has a need, he has a problem. And on this journey, 
he's meeting, he's getting a problem. He's meeting a problem, an external, internal problem. And then he's meeting a guide. And this is us as a coach. We are not the hero. We are the guide. And this is most people, experts, coaches do this wrong because they think I need to be the hero. This is me. You know, I have to be on the page. Yeah, I look great, you know, but this is wrong. This is a wrong mindset. We need to go from the place of, of a guide, of a helper, of a help for their for their problems. And we also have to think about what is our plan? What is the plan that we can give to our clients so they can take action, so we can inspire them to take action and they get the positive results and avoid the things that they want to avoid, okay? And this is my structure, this is my framework that I use for everything today. Uh, Farouk, I, I want to, to mention something what is uh, very, very important. Yeah. I think for everyone, uh, um, uh, when you, uh, it was a moment when you showed the card. Could you go back to the slide? Which one? Uh, where, where, yes, to this one. Why? Um, because uh, just imagine how much pain uh, should you feel to go through the transformation. That's that's a very important point, yeah. I think, for every single human in our life. Because while we don't feel the pain, while we don't uh, experience, uh, the, you know, the, 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 I, I don't know how to call this, but... It's like a, a, a blind spot that we don't see the, the opportunities. Yes. And if we don't feel the pain, we, we, we don't see the opportunities or we, we don't learn, we don't create that. Uh, this is awareness, this, this is mindset. And that's what, what the people can, can understand. Uh, yes. And another um, very important thing is that, uh, all uh, three of us, we are artists. <laughs> it's and uh, you, me, and Tony as well. So thank, Great. thank, thank you. Hey, thank you, thank you for having me again. Should I continue or? Yes, yes. Okay. So, um, what's happened in my life? I I get a mind shift with this framework that I discover, and then. I get also a different kind of identity because when you are here on stage as an artist, it's all about you. Okay. As an artist, it's all about you. It's me. I'm on stage physically. Okay. Everybody is clapping for me. Yeah. I'm the one. Okay. But this is different. Entrepreneurial game is different. Okay. What is changed yeah. uh, within you? In my, in my mind shifts the way of thinking, it's not about me, it's all about them. It's all about my customer and his problem and how I can resolve that problem, okay? This was a huge mind shift for me because now I always think in the skin of my client, mm -hmm. how he's feeling, how, what he's needing, you know? This is because more value you give, and more success you will have. Yes. You know? Sharing it's, is scary. It, it is like a boomerang. It's, it is really like a boomerang. And more value you give, more value than others, this is where success is coming, you know? But anyway, so I come from the pain, you know, all uncomfortable situation, this is all growing happening, you know? From pain, it's you grow somehow. And this is a nice thing that let's talk about. He talked about, he said, problems are power. Yes. You know, we need to have a mind shift about this. And also what's going on today. Anyway, fast forward. This is what happened with my agency. I, we become the agency of Porsche. This is the boss of Porsche. And this was my success. When, when I had all these shifts and mindset shifts, etc., And uh, yeah, it was a game changer. So anyway, and then fast forward till 2020 in March, COVID crashed to our life and our income 
from six figure business to zero figure business. Wow. No income in March. Okay. So then like, like for everyone. Exactly. And this is what we did then. Okay. Again, a hardship, again, pain and again, problem. Okay. What we do now, my wife and me, we look into, in, we look to, in, uh, to each other in the eyes and we said, she's Italian power, powerhouse again, you know, powerful woman. <laughs> yeah. Powerful woman as well. And we looked to each other in the eyes. We said, Amore, we don't watch now all day long TV over the COVID and see how many infections are around the world, how many people die. We just stand up and we implement and build everything that we planned seven years. All the We have a book of ideas that we always write down. And over the seven years, we said, we open this book now and we check what we can build, what we can implement, all the stuff and what we can build. And the idea was, our next step was to build a business, to build a virtual business and work from anywhere. Okay, this was our goal. And then we said, okay, let's just go out there and let's just start to coach everybody. And we coach just everybody. Everybody that come to front of us, we coach them, you know? <laughs> it was crazy. You know, from family members, friends, and uh, 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 work, like co-workers, uh, uh, colleagues, we coach us everybody, and we, we know, we end up with over one hundred coaching sessions. You know, it was crazy. Yeah, I have a question. How yeah. did you attract your clients? Uh, what kind of strategy did you use to attract the so, clients? So those were just people that we know, mm -hmm. just people that we know. So, so warm a, acquisition, kind of warm audience, a warm you know, acquisition. Warm, yeah, exactly, but. Over the 100 coaching sessions, we generate 30 clients, like 30 clients, you know, mm -hmm. 30. It was great. And then uh, beginning of September, on 7th of September, we said, okay, now we launch our membership site. Finally, Digital Life Upgrade, we put everything together. I come to this later when you want to have a look at it, what we're really doing here. But anyway, I just want to give you a mindset what's really going on in this world right now. You know, the great lockdown is get really accelerate the digitization. Yeah. Always more and more. I heard about like 5 billion people go online now and learn yeah. and they are forced to go online. And this is crazy what's going and on. And they invest right? a lot in, in the coaching industry. Yes. Yes. You know, here, the consumer, like online buying, consuming is really increased like crazy data solar huge... research <laughs> yes or here you know global education yeah 1.38 billion in 2023 it's crazy or uh, here here you have a clear coronavirus searches on google look at these numbers in march boom explodes so people are searching online for problems that they can resolve, for things that they want, the needs that they have, you know. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Or another thing here. E-learning so, platforms. Yes, e-learning platforms. Like people are searching for, for, uh, for learning new things online. Yeah, yeah. You know, yeah. this increase 8% from 2020 till 2026. And in 2026... The business e-learning business will hit 375 billion. Yeah. Yeah. That's those are crazy numbers. Okay. Yeah, and, it's it's unbelievable. <laughs> yeah. And there are opportunities for people that has wisdom to share, that has a message to share. There are huge opportunities right now. Okay. To go online and build a business. So I'm here also to deliver some great value. So when you are in a place and you want to turn your passion, your ideas into an online business and you want to share your message with the world and, and, um, and make a huge impact to other people's lives, okay, then I have a great five strategies I put here together um, for you guys because you're in a circle Everyone of Veronica. Needs that. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> and I put the, uh, together five strategies for your success when you're starting out. 
First, commit to your topic and sales. Okay, sales, you see? Look, this is digital products. You see how fast you can change things? <laughs> yeah, yes. <laughs> you don't have to inventory, etc. cetera. Yeah, you see, da, 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 change. So first thing, commit to your topic. When you have topic, commit to it for at least one, two years. Because a lot of people's, a lot of people are creators. They are constantly creating things, constantly. Stop creating. I know it's hard, but stop creating and focus on one topic and try to commit to this topic and commit to sales as well. Because sometimes we come out from artist life and creativity. Yes, but it's crazy. In, exactly. <laughs> but influencing, without to know how to influence people, yeah. you will be never able to sell your product. This yeah. is really, this is, this is it. It's a struggle um, uh, which a, a lot of, of entrepreneurs are, 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 um, are struggling with because, you know, sales is the most scaring for, for the most of the people. They, yes. don't know, they don't know how to sell. Yes. They don't know what to say. Could you tell uh, hear more about, please, about this, this the sales? Because yeah, you from, said that you, you have got uh, many clients yes. all at once. <laughs> I'm very curious yes. about. I mean, the most important thing is you have to understand your audience and you have to understand their problem and their pain. There's a lot of people that are on the way. They're really manipulative with neuro-linguistic programming and NLP techniques, etc. But this is not my type. Mm -hmm. I'm a really, let's say, a soft seller. <laughs> <laughs> soft? Understand <laughs> the problem. You know, when you are overweight, let's say, okay, let's say somebody is coming and he's overweight and you want to sell him a gym membership site, okay? It is something great for him. When he's doing a membership site, like uh, um, he's purchasing the contract for one year, imagine what could happen in his life. He could go the, uh, the, the stairs better up. His life could change. His social life could change. His working life could change. Everything could change. And this is what we ha where you have to focus on to the end result for your client at the end, you know? And for me, selling, it's all about asking questions and discovering yeah. what is the problem and understanding in a deep way. And then say, look, or you have the product or you have the information for him or you have the service for him or, and, uh, and say, look, I have something really great for you with confidence why why you want to cover yourself when you have a present when you have a gift you don't do this um do you, do you want my present <laughs> or um please <laughs> no you don't do this when you're exciting you say okay this can change your life yes here this is for you you know and this is what most people are not uh, understanding. They try to be manipulative and telling a lot of things and try to sell in a hard way. This is not really my type. And for me, it's also like when I talk with somebody and I see through asking questions that he is actually not my perfect target or not my perfect audience, I'm saying, okay, I understand you. I totally understand you. But I have somebody that maybe could help you. You know, I'm connecting him with somebody else, but really serious, you know, and this is what we all should do. I think also when you promise something and you cannot deliver it, this is also really toxic and this is also goes yeah. in the wrong direction, you know. Yeah. So, um, I is that or do you have another question about selling? 
uh, no, I was only curious about your approach um, okay. because I have been in sales for many years. So I have uh -huh. been a representative in the network marketing and communication. Oh, and great. so there we collaborated with 25 countries in the world. Mm -hmm. And I have had many mentors from Canada, United States, uh, wow. Netherlands, Spain. Oh. And okay. I'm very, very grateful so to all my mentors because they <laughs> changed my mind. <laughs> they changed my men uh, my personality. So they have invested truly a lot of energy, knowledge, and their experience so in, oh. in me. Okay. Um, and I appreciated it a lot. So I can uh, name as well their names. So uh, Miriam yeah. de la Sierra, so it's a, a business lady uh, yeah. from Spain. Okay. Her husband, Bash Bukari, you can okay. have a look on YouTube, you can find all these people. Oh, great. Mm. Uh, uh, and uh, Igor Olshinitsky, he was my first mentor, Igor Olshinitsky from Canada. He's also oh. an artist. Oh my gosh, I'm attracting all artists. <laughs> You see, you yeah. see a resonance. Yeah, yeah. It's a frequency. <laughs> yes, a frequency. Yeah. <laughs> we yeah. attract the same people. Yeah, yeah. exactly. <laughs> so should I, should I continue with this? Yes. Or Okay, yes. great. So this is the first thing. Commit to your topic and commit to selling. Okay? Yeah. First of the most important thing. Second, create your offer grids. You know what I mean with this? Yeah. Have, you know, try to lay out when you're starting out, just from the beginning, lay out three kind of different kind of topics. The first topic has to be a low tier product. And this goes from $1 till $97 range. Second product should be a $97 to $500 range. And the third can be from $500 till ten thousand dollar it's mm -hmm. a high tier mm -hmm. product so you have a low tier product a mid tier product and a high tier product okay it create the second create your offer grid once you put this down it's a kind of brainstorming for me and you just try to you get kind of a, a great mind storming and great ideas through that and this is also what's Ferrari is doing. Mm -hmm. This is also what Apple is doing. All the great products are made in the same strategy. Okay? Like Apple. You know, Apple start with iPods, costed 70 euro or dollar. Yeah. And I, I mean, who has at home uh, Apple phone, Apple iPad, uh, a MacBook, an iMac. <laughs> I know, I'm crazy. I have all of them. And this D is so different, crazy. Different versions of... of uh, yeah. <laughs> I think I'm one of the best clients for her, for them, you know? <laughs> so, but I'm really discovering... Also, Ferrari is doing this. You know, Ferrari is bringing, bringing out a car that costs 1 million... No, 1.4 million dollar. And on the other side, they produce like... A little bit the same type of a car that costs 200,000 euro. And you cannot imagine how the sales goes up. Yeah. You know? So, it's, uh, it's about upselling. So uh, yeah. I want to, to add something uh, related to this topic because it's very important. So uh, because yeah. I'm a business uh, coach, yeah. uh, we call uh, this a uh, business model. Business model. So you, ha you can create different business models uh, mm -hmm. through you can your uh, money generate your income yeah yes and as you said so it's a variation of products and that's exactly. very important because you have to create uh, uh, different uh, um, income streamings yes uh, it's uh, uh, for a starter for example if if uh, someone starts uh, uh, with the entrepreneurship uh, yeah. to not get confusion so okay they need to focus uh, uh, only on one product but for experienced 
people like me because I have been so in this industry for mm -hmm. many years, for more mm -hmm. than 10 years. Yes, great. Wow. So um, I don't recommend uh, the, the people to, uh, to focus only on, on one product. Why? Because especially in this pandemic time, yeah, you mm -hmm. have to create different uh, uh, income streams. Yes. To just to to create the, the the security for for your seller. Yes, and you have to also imagine your customer can has can have different problems, and more advanced your advice, you know, more expensive your advice becomes, your product becomes, more in depth becomes your information as well. You have yeah. to keep this also in mind, you know. Because people has different kind of problems, and you have to understand what are the problems, what is the timeline for them, what they have to learn first, second, third, and and what is also not existing that you could charge for higher money. You know, this is also a really important thing. Yes, and um, I really discovered this from many many experts and thought leaders that do the same way, and I really implement this also in my in my business as well okay mm -hmm. so second thing create your offer grid just brainstorming put it down i know when you use these five strategies you will start out great so third strategy is create your messaging theme you need to have a messaging theme what is your theme of messaging okay this is what most people do wrong when they're starting out. Most people, okay? You, you have to know what is your messaging and you have to repeat, always repeat this messaging, okay? They so, don't know because they don't, they don't have knowledge about branding, how to create uh, uh, your own branding. Yeah. And your message, I will add uh, uh, some uh, value to, to mm -hmm. this topic because your message you can um, uh, express through your mission yeah yes, and absolutely. so you have to create your your slogan mm -hmm. um many many companies they are using so this kind of, of strategy or, or all the companies in the world yeah. uh, but that's what a lot of people don't understand so that um uh, this uh, this short sentence is the value of of the business of their business or of yeah. your or mine or or your yes. your story so yes. through through True. your mission so you are expressing uh the value as well of of your own company of of what you are providing to the people exactly exactly and one thing is also really really important you have to be passionate about it yes this is so important because most people do this because they want to make more money. Okay. Just to make more money is a long term cost. When you come yeah, in, this it business, takes a long time. Yeah. When you come in this business just to make money, forget it. Don't start even, you know, come into in this business to truly help other people change their life. But you have to love them. the people to can help them. Exactly. Exactly. And um, this is so important. And also this messaging is, is one of the most important things. So people remember you when you tell your story, when you uh, uh, say always what, who you will help and why you will help them. More you do it, it's like manifest in other people's brain, you know, and this is so mm -hmm, important mm -hmm. to, to commit also to your messaging and create your messaging theme. So this is the third one. Fourth strategy is invest in your tools. We are in the middle of digitization, but in a huge way. There's no coming back anymore. Everybody understood the internet is power. We will not come back to normal anymore. We will stay like this. Most businesses they already pivot. They, there's no way back. And we need tools today to automate things, you know, to automate our communication, to uh, uh, put our online courses up, to um, 
uh, to do those kind of stuff here, share ideas, share uh, and s discovery opportunities, etc. You know, we have to s spend money on our tools to, yeah, to make our business more professional. You know, this is so important. And most people say, oh my God, I have to pay here again something. I have to pay <laughs> I know this is one part of it, you know. Yeah. Of course, there are more expensive products. There are more less products, you know. But you have to be able to invest in your tools. In your tools, I don't mean online products now or digital products. I mean, uh, uh, like, look, this mic here or this camera here. Yeah, before yeah. I use this everything everything <laughs> <laughs> I start with this first I was like I was always going in front of the camera I was like uh, my name is um, okay I have to start different my name is Farag and, and, and I have to start again different you know <laughs> you know I so so crazy how I started out and now I built this virtual business uh, this virtual business and virtual room for me I invest in my camera I invest in my lights I invest in my microphone, I invest in hard disk, etc. And um, I, I, I'm investing in Kajabi as well. Kajabi is an online platform where, you, where I can put all my mm -hmm. uh, uh, information products on. And um, so you have to invest in those kind of tools. Otherwise, you cannot do your business in a professional way. Okay. I there are, of course, different kind of platforms than Kajabi that are less expensive mm -hmm, mm -hmm. but then maybe they don't work that great you know i don't want to criticize but i'm a big fan of kajabi that's why I'm, i say kajabi i'm a big great. fan of billy jen billy jen ah billy jen is a yes an expert right yeah 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 i know i know billy jen i know he's great yes. i <laughs> have a member yeah <laughs> yes he is very powerful i love powerful. That, uh, his power yeah, yeah and i have a membership so um to him and yeah. every single uh, day like i have a look uh, on my uh, membership account online and every single day i'm keep learning because always there is something new to discover yeah but related to this uh, topic invest in your tools um i have a segment of the mindset mm -hmm. what uh, the people have to understand what they should invest in their tools mm -hmm. is the value of of what uh, uh, can deliver the tools to them you know, yes. it's about understanding the value of what you uh, in what you are investing, because just imagine, just tell me you, for example, before where, where you you was an uh, artist, how many thousands of euros have you invested in in another things that you didn't understand nothing from that no, money, no. for example. Even even in information, I, I yeah. invest so much money in information and online courses, yeah. masterminds, so much money over the seven years, you know, I invest, I calculated last time over 70,000. It's a lot of money. It's, yeah. Yeah. It's a lot of money. And, uh, but I'm, because I'm passionate about it, you know, yeah. and it brings me always more further. And finally I can use all of these things that I learn also, you know, yeah so number four is invest in your tools really really important five is you have to challenge yourself to launch in 90 days or less what gets scheduled gets done you know you have to schedule it you have to have a start point and an end point when you don't do this it's over Procrastination. you have to set a deadline Exactly, a deadline. When you don't do this, you get procrastination, you get overwhelmed, out, and you don't do nothing. You know what you do? You go on social media and check what other people are doing. <laughs> this is what you do. You have experienced that? <laughs> I have experienced it by myself. So I don't have time for, for social media, truly. <laughs> I know. Like me, I, I'm I'm using this for work, but I'm really get really conscious. Yesterday we did a class with my wife together, you know, how to be more present with your loved ones, 
with your partner. You know, we sometimes you lie together with your partner and you watch on your phone, you know. <laughs> <laughs> it's crazy what's going on today. But there are people working on these platforms. They're all day long. They, they are specialized to get your intention, you know. And I think, I really truly believe we need to upgrade ourselves. What is digitization? And we have to be intentional with that. Really intentional and consciously what we are doing and when somebody is close to us, he's trying to talk to you and you are on your phone, you know, this is <laughs> common today. It's common today, you know. Yeah, those are my five uh, uh, ideas that are really important when you are starting out. When you want to take this opportunity today, you know, we, we saw the graphs. People are searching on Google today still COVID is we are in the middle of COVID right now and it's a great opportunity when you're in a place maybe you lost your job and I'm really sorry for that you know maybe you are really in a hard situation now you know and uh, I, I know this feeling I really can understand you when you're watching right now because to me happened the same but we are made to win we are made to see opportunities in every crisis, in every problem. Like how I said, problems are opportunities to master the subject, to master, to, um, to get to the next level. And all next level, it gets created from uncomfortable situations. There's no growth in a comfortable situation. No growth. And believe me, everybody can do this. When I can do this, you can do this as well. I'm not special. Okay? You can yeah, do this as well. But they and have to believe in, in, in their uh, power and their knowledge. Or if uh, the people don't have um, uh, knowledge, uh, just keep learning. That's, that's, that's the way how you can grow. Yes. Because is, I can imagine, especially people from the scratch who, who are not familiar with, with a new industry, especially coaching industry, you need a lot of tools, a lot of knowledge, but just keep learning. That's absolutely. the only way how you, 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 you can move forward. Yes, absolutely. Yes, absolutely. Yeah, we have to, we, we are responsible for everything. Yeah. You are responsible for everything. You know, we are responsible for everything what's going on in our life. When the environment is changing, when the world is changing, it's our work to change ourselves, you know, to have a different kind of mindset, to do things, to um, connect with like-minded people. And, you know, this is a really important thing as well. And, um, and take care to our health that we that we stay energized, that we stay healthy, that we can still take care to our family, to our daughter, to our partner, okay? And um, that's why it's our choice what we are doing every day, every second, every minute. And that's why I want to give this as well because some people, you know, they like to say, you know, but I'm not born like that. Or I think I cannot do this. This is too much tech for me you can do this you can get all the information in the world through internet through google through youtube you can do everything okay we That's have just... so many available tools so much available yeah. information for free only from the free information you can learn incredible a lot Exactly. If you want to, to transform yourself, of course. Go to Veronica. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. So um, should I should I tell something about my membership site, Veronica? Yes, yes. Yeah? Of course. It's, it's okay. important. You know, to adapt your life and get more, you know, get more coaching clients and grow your business, you have to become a good role model as well. You know, a good role model, physically, mentally, emotionally. And, um, and improve the key areas of your life. But 
I really see there is a problem as well. You know, like how I said before, maybe you are overwhelmed or uh, self-developing is expensive for you. Information is overload. You have a lack of credibility or uh, nobody give you the right plan or you you have the missing you you are missing the right community as well you know and this is so common those problems are really common and that's why I'm, we we created this great community called digital life upgrade this is everything what a coach needs to adapt his life and grow his business fast in the digital economy and um yeah this is the this is the program what we're doing in this program is we have a great community where you get accountability, inspiration, and motivation. And we work here on your business as well, weekly. Mm -hmm. We're building four digital products. Every 90 days, we build a new product, information product. So we turn your passion, your ideas, your wisdom into an online product, into an online business, in virtual business. And then what we else is doing, my, this is my wife, by the way. She's going weekly with the members online and she's training the body to generate more energy and get more productive. This is so important point. I really, this is also what Tony Robbins always says, you know, you have to, you have to be more, and energy is everything. When you don't have energy, you cannot take care to your kids, you cannot take care to your partner, yep. you cannot build the business you want, you cannot create the life you want, you know, yep. and Georgia is so focused on it. She's a powerhouse. She's, uh, she's bringing the members to a complete different level, healthy in the energy level, etc. And then once a month, Georgia and me, we go also live and we share our, about our relationship, how we evolve our love relationship. We talk about how we resolve conflicts, how we become an entity, how we regulate our emotions and, um, so with all the purpose of protecting your emotion and, you know, emotions are like, I really see emotions like, like you train a muscle, mm -hmm. you know, and this is also based on problems when you have problems, when you, a lot of people that has a lot of muscles, they train the muscle so hard, so the muscle gets hurt and then the muscle is growing. And this is, with our emotions, with our mental game as well, you know, we have to, we have to train our muscles, our emotion, emotional muscles, our mental muscles, our spiritual muscles. And this is what we're doing as well here in this program. Yeah, this is it. This is what we're doing. I don't know. Uh, we never talk about an offer here, but I've, uh, I thought about something small here just for your community. And um, do you want that I represent this, Veronica? Um, yeah. Uh, do you have I'll some uh, something more to to tell? Do you do or? No, 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 no. I I just wanted to give you a special offer here for this community as well. But when you don't want it, it's no problem. Okay, we will uh, talk uh, afterwards okay. about this. All right, great. Okay, so this is it. This is it. I hope this was really informational for you. And yeah, um, yeah it, it makes sense. Thank you so much. I think that uh, many uh, entrepreneurs need your services because so, but I have a question. Do, uh, do you implement as well the digital services or um, how do you work? What is your way uh, uh, to, to work with, with the people? I'm, this is not an online course. This is not a usual online course. I'm going live with the members here every mm -hmm. week. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm, and, I'm, and I'm really helping them. I, I'm the accountability person. I'm answering the questions, etc. from week to week, okay? Mm -hmm. And all the recordings getting into the members area. And uh, yeah, this is how we're doing. And this is, there are all coaches inside and really, really great minds, really skilled people that we have doctors, PhD with PhD, etc. Really great minds we have mm -hmm. in our membership side. Yeah. Okay, really interesting. Yeah, purposeful space, absolutely. Yes. Yeah, cool. 
So thank you so much uh, for your introduction, for your presentation and these valuable uh, tools, because these tools are, are incredible uh, of high value for the people who understand this, because it, it can change your life. It can change everything. Yes. Uh, now I would like to introduce Tony. <clears throat> can I, last yeah. thing? Veronica, thank you again for having me. I have to do also dinner for my wife now. Yes. You know. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> Wish you a, a blessed I, afternoon. <laughs> enjoy, I like, enjoy your I like time your with purpose. your family. I like your purpose. I like what you're doing and you inspire the people and you give opportunities. Really great. Really Th great. Thank, thank you so you much so for much. having me again. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you, you too. So we will talk afterwards. Yeah. Exactly. Hi, Tom. Tony. Hi, Farouk. Nice to meet you, Farouk. That nice to meet great, you as uh, well. I enjoyed your talk today. That was that was fabulous. That was really good. Thank Very you. much on point, my friend. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Look Let's forward to up. look forward to catching up soon. Yes. <laughs> yes. Have a great one. Thank you. Bye bye. Bye bye. Together. Thank you. Stay great. Bye bye. Mm -hmm. Hey, Veronica. How are you doing? Hi, Tony. Nice to having you here. So it's my pleasure to see you again. Mm -hmm. um, Always a pleasure to see you, Veronica. <laughs> thank you so much. So uh, as you see, I have invited uh, Farouk Gunes. Um, he's a digital uh, marketer. He has um, a lot of experience in digital marketing, but as well in a holistic approach of coaching. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh, nice. So just tell uh, us more about yourself. Who are you? What are you doing? Uh, a little bit about your experience, your purpose, mission and vision. Yes, thank you. Well, I am just excited to be here today because I have some really fun, exciting stuff that I want to share. Yes. Uh, I'm Tony Wexler, of, to introduce myself, and uh, I'm here in New York State, in the United States right now, where it is almost two o'clock in the afternoon. And so I just had lunch uh, before I, uh, I hopped on here. So it's been, uh, and it's actually snowing outside uh, a little bit. We've got some snow here on the ground, uh, but that's something that we have to deal with here in, uh, in upstate New York. But anyway, I am a teacher, a trainer, uh, I had been an investigator for many years and I took the transition of going from an investigator to a coach. So my business is Tony W Coaching, TonyWCoaching.com. And I also uh, produce a podcast and host the podcast called Strive to Thrive, the Purposely Positive Podcast, which is about bringing positive content into the world. Now, we talked about this uh, in a discussion we had recently, Veronica, and about how there's so much negativity in the world right now. Yeah, so we don't need the negativity. No, and I want to bring positive content out there. I want to be able to help people. You know, Farouk talked a lot about delivering value and the importance of that when he was talking earlier, and that is so true, and that's what I want to do on my podcast. Uh, I want to bring value out there so that people can learn things. Right now, we're doing a, uh, we're finishing up something called New Year, New You. And every week we've had a new topic regarding how to start the new year off right. This week we're talking about new year and a new start, a new beginning and how to start all over. So actually that kind of uh, brings me into the introduction of what I want to talk about today. So uh, basically I want to ask people listening, uh, where are you headed in 2021? And where do you really want to go? You know, there are different paths out there, really, that we can take. Uh, first, we can all stay on that very same path that we're on right now. But, you know, Veronica, as you probably know from your experience as a coach, if people stay on the path, they're going to continue to get the same results that they've been getting. Yes. And, and unless they're happy with those results they need to change paths. Uh, I also refer to this same path as the comfort zone. Uh, 
because I think we need to get out of our comfort zone. And the interesting thing about that is most of the time our comfort zone is not really what we want. It's what we're used to and change is very difficult for people. Some people like to stay in a comfortable place, but you know, there's an old story about the frog and cooking a frog by putting the frog in the water and you slowly turn up the heat. And by the time he realizes that the heat has turned up so much, it's too late for him to do anything about it. And I think that's what our comfort zone does to us. We're sitting there like these frogs, you know, oh, okay, we're just going along, along, and all of a sudden life just consumes us. So we really want to break out of that. So uh, sec the second thing is, uh, uh, well, in talking about what paths we want to take, you know, there's the same path, but then there's the path of negativity. And that's the belief, and I've seen a lot of people during COVID go down this path, and they just believe things are going to get worse, and they always look at the negative in everything. You know, have you met people like that? You'll be talking, and they're going to talk about, oh, you know, the numbers are up for COVID now. Oh, we're in <laughs> lockdown. We can't do anything. My business is suffering so badly, and they are trying to focus on the things they can't control. They are not looking for solutions. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Because really, if we can't control it, then why are we worrying about it? I want to control the things that I can control. Yes. You know, if yes. if it's snowing outside and you, I'm sure, driven in the middle of a snowstorm, you can't like, you know, divinely make that snowstorm disappear. You just have to control what you can control, and that's that car that you're driving. So you have to take control of your own life. So that's where we go down the third path. And the third path is the positive path. And that's the path that leads us in the right direction. That's the path where we make positive changes in our life. So what happens with most people where they have to decide what path to go down is they have what I call a wake up call moment. Now I write about this in my ebook called Strive to Thrive. And you can actually download it off my website, TonyWCoaching.com. Uh, it's, it's about 12, 15 pages. It's, it's a free ebook. But anyway, what it talks about is when you get that wake up call moment in your life, that's when something hits you and you realize that, you know what, I can't keep doing things this way. COVID was a huge wake up call for a lot of businesses because they realized that they had to make change or they were going to go out of business. And some people did lose their businesses and they had to realize, now what am I going to do? That's a wake up call. Uh, in your personal life, maybe you're in a relationship and something happens to that relationship. In March on my podcast, we're going to be talking about relationships because February is the month of Valentine's Day. So yeah. we're going to talk about that. And one of the uh, episodes, we talk about going from a breakup to a breakthrough. Yeah. because we took that wake up call of a breakup and used it to go down the positive road. So that is what a wake up call moment is. And I had a wake up call moment in my life and I've had several, I'm sure you have as well. In fact, yes. I know you have, we talked about that yes. uh, a while back, but one of my wake up calls was when I was very young. Uh, I was, uh, I was 23 when I bought my first house and doing pretty good after college i worked for a local company called eastman kodak they were a film company they make film production mm -hmm. and the company started going downhill because digital photography started to gain more momentum and kodak didn't know what to do so they laid off a lot of people so i lost my job so instead of just moping around and going woe is me i'm out of work what am i going to do I took that wake up call to take myself in a positive direction. And what I did was I realized that real estate at that time might be a good career to go in. Yeah. So I got all the knowledge I needed to learn. I took courses. I, I didn't have a coach back then because coaching wasn't as popular back then as it mm -hmm. is now. I wish I did have a coach. If I had a coach, maybe that coach would have been able to keep me in that business because like I was in my probably mid 20s and that career unfortunately didn't work out but that's where i learned another important lesson and that's about failure now most of us look at failure and say failure is a bad thing oh no i failed at this but really the more failures you make in life 
the more successful you'll become yeah. because failure is a lesson. You learn from that. Yes. Yeah, the most successful people in the world were probably failures if you look at their history. Uh, look at baseball. I don't know if you're a baseball fan, but here in America, we love our baseball. It's one of our top sports. And yep. one of the all-time great hitters in baseball history was a Babe Ruth was his name. And he was the home run king. He hit more home runs than any other baseball player. But what most people don't realize is not only was he the home run king, he was also the strikeout king. So he failed as many times as he succeeded, but we don't remember him for his failures. We remember him for his success. So when we fail, if we take that failure and learn a lesson, uh, have you ever eaten Kentucky Fried Chicken? Yes. Yes. <laughs> I well, love that. <laughs> uh, yes, it's it, the the uh, the spice recipe. Colonel Sanders. He was he was in his in his mid to late sixties, and he developed that recipe. And now Colonel Sanders was a sixth grade dropout. And he went from restaurant to restaurant to restaurant trying to sell this recipe to try to come up with franchising. And he had these great ideas and he was rejected over a thousand times. But what he had was the fact that he didn't give up. He was determined to succeed. And because of his determination, we can now eat that Kentucky Fried Chicken today. <laughs> You know, I have studied uh, because I'm passionate about business coaching. I have studied um, uh, about his strategy and recipe, and I was like uh, a blo blown away, you know, about the, uh, this strategy and um, how much time he he has uh, tried and retried, you, you know, just to, to promote himself and his recipe. Uh, I wanted one time as well to to be qualified um, uh, for for uh, franchising, uh, but in Netherlands it's very hard to get that. Um, okay. It's it's very very hard. So you have to 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 be qualified. It's uh, more about your background. It's not about money, but. Uh, you need to to have experience so uh in the oreca we call yeah yes absolutely and that yes. wake up call will, will yeah will, will propel you to where you want to yeah, go you, you have to be specialized so in in that industry otherwise you you don't get the qualifications so mm -hmm. but it's very very interesting Yes, yeah, definitely. The other story, one of my favorite stories is in the book, Think and Grow Rich by Napoleon Hill. And he talks about uh, R.U. Darby and his uncle the, who had bought the mine and but they got to a point where they just gave up. And when they went back and the person who bought the mine did some studies they realized that they had stopped three feet away from gold and i think that is the biggest mistake that most entrepreneurs most business people make today and really we make it in our personal lives too we give up when we're just inches away from where we're going to succeed so uh, i'm going to talk a little bit more about determination uh mm -hmm. you know, a little bit but uh yeah we we're talking about that wake up call moment and also, uh, we were talking. Also, you were talking to Farouk about you know being artists, and uh, I'm a musician myself. Yeah. And uh, one of the uh, rock bands that I used to listen to, still do, I guess, is a band called Rush. And I don't know if you're familiar with them, but uh, they are a three-piece band. Uh, Getty Lee was the songwriter and just an amazing bass player, and I'm a bass player, so uh, they wrote a song called Free Will. And there is a line in the song Free Will that says, if you choose not to decide, you still have made a choice. So when we get that wake up call moment and we choose, we're not going to decide to go down the negative path or go up, down the positive path. We're going to stay where we are. We still have made a choice. We just choose not to decide. And I think that's where a lot of us are in the world today. You know, something happens and we just we don't want to make that decision. We avoid that decision. But you know so, what is the most difficult difficult to, to the people to make a decision? Yes. That's the it most is. difficult in life for, for for most of the people because 
when you are at that point to, to make a decision or you move forward or, or you stay there where you are. Mm -hmm. And even if you think that it's comfortable, but at the same time, it's painful, uh, a lot of people, they are choosing to don't go through the transformation because the transformation is very painful. Like Farouk told uh, mm -hmm. about his accident, a uh, car accident, yeah? Yes, exactly. To, it's a very, to, it's, to get the the awake call, you know, he must uh, uh, go through through that, that accident. Mm -hmm. Yes, and that was a big wake up call moment yes. and something like that, an accident. And, you know, he could have chosen to go down the other path, but he chose to take the right path. And that's where he is, where he is today. And he's the person he was today. And he he is he got the growth that he got. And that's where we all want to find. We want to get that transformation, that growth. Um, and really, that's how we can get to choose the life that we want to live. And we that's where we can get that designer life. We get to design our own life. So one of the things about that negative path I was talking about, uh, if you take the negative path, what you're really doing is you're letting those things in your life that you can't control, control you. And one of the most frustrating things that happen in our life is when we feel like we're not in control. Have you had that happen where something happened to you and you just felt you're not in control of the situation? Yeah. And how did that feel? Yeah, it's like you are stuck at that moment and you, you want to control that, but you, you don't have the control on, on the things. And the only thing what remains is to accept the situation and to move forward. Yes, accept that situation, move forward and take the positive yeah. path. Because when we choose our path, what we're really choosing, Veronica, we're choosing our identity. Yeah. And if we really want to design our life story, everything starts with identity. Yes. Very defines it as the distinguishing character or personality of an individual. Now, in the, in the business world, we call our identity something else. We call that our brand. Our brand and our identity is what makes us stand out. So if you want to really distinguish yourself and make a name for yourself, this is where everything starts. So it starts with your identity. And if you want to get lasting change in life, one of the things we need to do is to take charge of our identity, choose who we want to be. Your identity is defined by two things. The first thing is who we think we are and who we think we're not. <laughs> so the other thing is regarding identity is that willpower, you know, a lot of times we get up and we say, we're going to push through and we're going to use our willpower to do this, but willpower doesn't last. How many times have you decided I'm going to go to the gym now, or I'm going to start this workout routine, or I'm going to go on this diet. And then after a few days, our willpower just poops out on us. And <laughs> we, we just, willpower won't work. If you're not getting the results that you want, it's because of your identity. And it's because your beliefs that you have are in the way. Yes, because, so, because of the convictions and limiting beliefs that you don't Somebody, believe enough so in in, yep. in in your mission yeah we get to choose that mission and you know to me that's the exciting part of life is that it's about making those decisions and about making those right choices so let's choose to take that positive path let's choose to change our identity for the positive and let's choose to believe because belief along with a strong desire to succeed, those right there are the two most important keys to success. Believing in yourself, believing in what you're doing, believing in God, the universe that is behind you to do this, and on top of that, a strong burning desire to have that success in whatever that is. But you know, um, uh, from my experience, everything is related to, to belief. I uh, remember my uh, my health accident. Well, so you know, I told you about. Mm -hmm. But if I didn't believe in myself, I I couldn't survive. You know, mm -hmm. if I, I if I didn't believe so in myself, I couldn't be where I am today. 
I mean in front of you, in front of Farouk or, or in front of many other uh, um, uh, coaches, public speakers, so entrepreneurs, because so um, because of my belief, so I have been able to, to create this network and um, to, to provide uh, uh, this, this high value because uh, what I think that the people have to understand the value that we are providing our experience and that's the belief. So mm -hmm. even, uh, you know, Tony Robbins said that uh, you cannot measure the um, or compare your own uh, uh, success with the success of someone else. So you know why? Because for someone else, it takes longer than than for the another one but mm -hmm. what's important to move forward you have to move forward so every yes. single day step by step step and that's the difference mm -hmm. exactly exactly and i was in a, a recently in a seminar with uh, a virtual seminar with tony robbins and mm -hmm. one of the things that he talked about is uh is that you know the importance of belief but in the importance to continue to succeed and to not quit because what usually happens is when we try to figure out where our business is going to go, we start a new company, we start a new business, we do something, we overestimate our success in the first year. Yeah. And you know, most businesses fail within the first year because we over, we basically overestimate that success. We think we're going to be doing so much better. One of the reasons why I failed as a real estate agent many, many years ago was because I was without a job. I didn't have any other source of income and I overestimated my success in real estate. And I ended up quitting because I wasn't getting the results that I wanted at the time. Now, if I would have known and stayed with it, then who knows? I probably would have succeeded and done very well, but then I wouldn't be where I am now. So again, that's another thing that we have to do is we, we can't look back at our failures and our past history, because it's already happened, we can't change it. Just like we can't change the circumstances around us, we can't control that. The past is something we can't control, but we can learn from that. And back again to belief, again, Napoleon Hill, uh, one of my favorite quotes from him is that anything the mind can conceive and believe, yeah. it can achieve. Yeah, I am uh, uh, definitely agree with you uh, because so uh, if I I uh, analyze my own life, if I uh, I will share uh, so all my life experience, I think that the people will cry when they will hear so my life experience. Um, I have had so many struggles. Mm -hmm. I have had so many struggles, uh, and I, uh, from from a single mom, uh, uh, and uh, you know, as as a woman, I have been able to to transform everything in my life, not only my own life, but the life of my family, too. Mm -hmm. So I took care of all the family, and I think this is very powerful. Uh, outside this, even if I have experienced a failure, I have been able to stand up and to move forward. So and that's, I think that's the power, you know, and because of that, so I, I called my YouTube channel, the power of your mind and inner. So just you have to believe, but you have as well to understand um, your potential so at at which level uh, is your actual potential because if you have too high expectations then okay you will fail because then you you get frustrated because of your expect expectations but just uh, be aware of uh, of of the level where you are at this moment mm -hmm. and another thing what i always um I repeat and I, I will repeat all the time uh, to learn to be grateful for what you have at this moment. 
if you will master this quality, it's a mindset skill. So then you, you will uh, learn to appreciate what you have and the value of what you have, and then you can move forward. That is so true. That is so true. You know, that really transitions me into a little bit about what I was going to talk about next, especially we're going to talk a little bit about that gratitude and that appreciation. But uh, what I wanted to share, Veronica, with you and the people listening is five steps, five things that you need to do to turn that wake up call moment and turn yourself down that positive path, positive path that will truly change your life. And uh, the first thing that we do is we have to make a decision to change because nothing in life can start without a decision. So you'll notice that all of these uh, five things are gonna start with the letter D. So it'll make it easy for you and for anybody listening. So the first D is decision. We have to make a decision. Now, Peter Drucker, uh, who's a successful author, uh, wrote that whenever you see a successful business, someone once made a courageous decision. Somebody made that decision to start that business. So everything starts with a decision and the decision would be to go down the positive path. The next one, number two, is to dream. We have to be willing and allow ourselves to dream and dream big. Think about if everything in your life was exactly the way you wanted it to be. Write that out and read it. And how would that feel? and read that to yourself every day. Imagine it, make it real, feel the emotions you feel because those emotions will actually be what is your driving force. Uh, Bob Proctor says that we should write down those goals but start it with this phrase, I am so happy and grateful that. And yeah. then we read our ideal life scenario. And just like you said, gratitude is a huge part of that. Uh, when we live our lives with an attitude of gratitude, uh, not only will we feel better, but the doors for us are going to open uh, because they're going to bring more things in our life for us to be thankful for. And I like to call that the law of appreciation, because if someone is in, in finance, the word appreciation or in real estate, appreciation means to go up in value. Yes. So the more we appreciate the things in our life, the more the things in that we value and the things that we have will grow in value. So that will attract things that we can appreciate more. And the more we will get, because when you learn to appreciate, you get more in return. So, and if you care, then you share with another people, yeah? Yes, exactly, exactly. So that gratitude is, is a huge belief uh, that I have. I get up in the morning and you know write down three things that you're grateful for and start your day with that meditate on it if you if you can so again we have a decision and then we have a dream and next we have to turn that dream into a desire and when we dream uh we have, again wishing alone is not desire wishing for something alone does not bring success uh, a desire uh, for something in our life becomes a state of mind when it becomes like an obsession. Mm -hmm. So when we can plan, uh, this is how we can plan definite ways to go after our goals. Uh, so when we back those plans with persistence and that persistence does not recognize failure, that is what brings us success. And it all, it all starts with a burning desire to make it happen. So like, Colonel Sanders had a burning desire to sell his, his chicken recipe and nothing that anybody said, all those thousand restaurants that slammed the door in his face and told him no, that wasn't going to stop him. Uh, I want to add something uh, that's very important uh, about uh, dreams. Uh, a lot of people, they don't dare to dream, you know, they don't have the courage to dream because of the reality where they are. Uh, mm -hmm. at that moment and but um, who takes uh, their dream serious he take action too and yes. is, there, is there about because okay uh, they don't dare to dream because they don't uh, take action but dream and at the same time take action so just fulfill your desires 
uh, just just take action and make it real uh, is there about it's it's not so complicated it takes time of course but nothing in this life we uh, uh, create in an easy way you know what i'm saying all the time that moscow is not in one day build it up so <laughs> that's right that's right exactly. or new york new york is it has uh, been not built it in one day no no it was not it's over here it's still being built yeah so, yeah yeah and it all started everything that, that everything in this world all started with a thought in someone's mind everything that we have in our life was born twice it was first born as a thought in somebody's mind this computer that i'm looking into the screen right now it was a thought the whole platform of facebook was a thought in someone's mind an before idea it happened. yeah an idea yes so a dream so to say that was someone's yes. dream yes. they made a decision they had a dream and they had a desire to make it happen and then that leads me to the fourth thing and that's determination because when, when we make a decision that when we're going to go for what's right in front of us and not quit one of my favorite quotes is from uh, one of our founding fathers here in america thomas jefferson and he said Nothing can stop the man with the right mental attitude from achieving his goal. Nothing on earth can help the man with the wrong mental attitude. Mm -hmm. If we have the right attitude and that attitude to determine, nothing can stop us. And that is so yes, important. Yes, yes, because the attitude determines the quality of our life, our relationship, our health as well. So everything what we have in our life. And then mm -hmm. you can imagine how powerful is um, the um, the awareness of of the power of our mind, uh, gratitude and attitude. So yes. there are three elements that I think that we have to be accountable with. Mm -hmm. Yes, that we definitely do. Uh, the, so the last of my my five is uh, is another D word, and it's the word deliver. We have to deliver what we say. If we really want to succeed in business we really do need to deliver and we need to provide the greatest value uh, to those who we serve and this is not only in our business but it's also in our personal life as well we need to really uh, we, we need to deliver we need to deliver great value i think farouk touched on providing value in his talk earlier yes. uh, now when i coach people when i teach someone my goal is not only to be there and just do a good job but my job is to provide as much value as possible and i i love to over deliver whenever i'm doing a talk something for free um, my free vision and strategy calls that i do with people and we're just talking to someone they're not even paid or paying me to coach them i'm just trying to help somebody out i'm always going to over deliver because that's why uh we or that's the reason uh that we're here uh, that makes us become our best self and that also helps us to really impact people's lives. And the more lives that we impact, my goal, and then. Bring. So again, we start out with a decision, we move into a dream, that dream builds into a desire. The desire is fueled by determination and we need to go out there and we need to deliver. And I'm going to give you a bonus for those yes. listening, another D word, and that yes. word is duplication. Because yes. when something really works, it's so important that we duplicate it. We teach others. And one yes. of the things I do at TonyWCoaching.com is I help people who are stuck in a rut and I help them move forward and determine what they truly want to achieve and what they truly want to avoid. Because there are two ways we make our decisions. We decide on things by what we want to achieve or we're motivated by what we want to avoid. For example, um, if I want to lose, let's say I, I want to lose 20 pounds. All right. So what I want to achieve is to lose uh, 20 pounds. What do I want to avoid? Well, I want to avoid eating all this junk food and feeling sluggish. So those are two things. And some people are more motivated by 
what they want to avoid than by what they want to achieve. So you have to figure out when you're talking to somebody where their motivation is. So again, I, I teach others to move forward in their life, live the life uh, that, they, that they've always wanted. And that is how I like to duplicate um, myself, you know, by teaching others, you know, maybe if I show someone some tools that they, that can help them, mm -hmm. they can go along and teach those tools to somebody else. Because you know what, when you learn something, the best way to learn something is to turn around and teach it to somebody else. Yes, of course. It's, it's about to, to sharing your expertise, your knowledge and your, your life experience. Uh, as I said it before, uh, if, uh, if you care, then you share. So that's, that's the meaning uh, of this proverb. Uh, caring is sharing. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. When it, yes, when you care about the transformation of another people, then you you have as well the accountability, yes, and the leadership about what you are doing. Mm -hmm. And that's what we do as coaches too: is we provide accountability to mm -hmm. people uh, yes. to help them because accountability is is so important. When someone is trying to make a change in their life, I like to work with them and figure out what can they do to make that change something that when will inevitably happen, that will happen automatically. And a lot of times, you know, that's so important. If you want to stop eating junk food, for example, um, best way to do that is to get rid of all the junk food in your house, because then you won't be there. You won't be tempted to eat it. Yes. So that is an inevitability move. If uh, when I started drinking more water every day, and my daughter laughs at me because every night before I go to bed, I have this water bottle and I fill it up with water and I take it up and I put it by my nightstand at night. Now, that is so when I wake up in the morning, I know here's my water. I'm going to drink this water first thing. I set myself up for success. I'm going to succeed. The only time I screw up, and this is where my daughter laughs at me, is I will leave the water bottle downstairs or forget to fill it up. And then I'll, be getting, <laughs> I'll, I'll wake up in the middle of the night and notice the water bottle's not there. So here I am at two in the morning going downstairs, picking up my water <laughs> bottle, bringing it up to my room. It's so it, it's, fun. yeah, it's about leadership and accountability to take yes. care of your self, self care mm -hmm. and love as well. Mm -hmm. Well, I've really, really, yeah, you know, enjoyed the opportunity to, to be on this webinar. Uh, if, if it's okay, I just like to say. Yes. That if anyone... So it 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 uh, it uh, was a honor to having you here. So I appreciate enormously uh, your time and that you have shared a lot of value with us. Uh, we are live on Facebook, so the people uh, pr probably they are watching us. Mm -hmm. But I wish you a blessed and. Um, um, and productive day and then i Thank see you, you soon <laughs> yes yeah I, I i really enjoyed being this and i just want to say that uh, a positive life and an exciting future is really the key to motivation and uh, we need to look forward to that positive and exciting future and if we really want to change our lives then uh you know most people i think just want to return to normal but normal is not compelling so I think uh, to make us move forward, I think we really need to dream big, believe in ourselves and make that determination to make 2021 the best year ever. So I wanna thank you, Veronica. This was so fun today. I thank you again. So uh, blessings and I see you soon. We keep in touch. Okay. Bye-bye. Right, bye -bye. Okay, so I would like to, to share uh, further my uh, presentation of this webinar with you. I was uh, looking for the presentation and I couldn't see my face. <laughs>
um, on the screen. That's why I uh, I was uh, switched so to to the presentation. Okay, here is the screen. I'm gonna try it again. Uh, I don't understand what is going on, but yes, now I'm here, I'm in. And so I was uh, here um, at this stage about me and then I have welcomed our guests, Farouk Gunas and Tony uh, Weschlers. So Farouk Gunas is living in Germany and Tony Weschlers in New York. Uh, the people who has watched uh, or is watching our um, live streaming or this webinar, they have seen that Farouk uh, is a uh, um, a digital marketing expert and at the same time a holistic coach uh, that they are uh, providing um, health and relationship coaching and how to, to, to improve uh, your productivity on daily basis. Um, <clears throat> So it's uh, already, I think, about half a year or more than half a year that I'm collaborating with Tony uh, Wesslers from New York. Um, so we uh, have different experiences together uh, and I love to work with Tony. It's amazing and Farouk too. So these persons are very, very inspiring. And uh, what I love, um, that uh, they have the human approach, what it's of the utmost importance so, to me. So now let's uh, go ahead. I was uh, telling about myself and uh, I have uh, had all the time uh, uh, my own companies. I'm a, a, a CEO, owner and founder of my own companies. So my first company I created in 2007. And <clears throat> then at the same time, uh, I have been a representative into the um, American organization ACN, where I have had a lot of mentors and I, I created my own team, which I coached for many years and then uh, collaborated with different counters in the world. And uh, here I acquired really a lot of knowledge and experience as a woman and a single mom. And from there that in um, in, in the time I have studied in the Netherlands, communication science, business development, and uh, in at the end of 2014, I have created um, another company um, specialized in business uh, development, project management, and, and, and uh, project development and marketing strategies, yeah. And so, there isn't uh, any difference uh, because so I have been dealing with marketing, with uh, projects and how to create companies. Uh, what I have done in 2020, I changed only this strategy. And <clears throat> the approach as well, because uh, now I have different uh, audience segments so it means that my is i'm providing my services for different uh, um, students uh, and and audience who want uh, first of all to work at their uh, mindset uh, pers personal development and who wants to to grow from the personal and professional point of view and uh, as well, people who, who want to turn their uh, pain, frustration and, and stress into abundance and to create their online business. So my mission is to guide you 
through all the frustrations, troubles, and to create abundance in your life. Um, <clears throat> so I have more than uh, um, 14 years experience in entrepreneurship. So I think it's, uh, it's a very, very long time and I have learned a lot. I have experienced um, failures as well. <clears throat> But you know, failures makes makes us <coughs> strong. <clears throat> Why? Because we learn a lot from failures. Who don't know the failures don't know now how to grow and what how to turn so the pain into power. That's the reason why I have uh, choose the <clears throat> my niche is on the basis of my experience. And of course, I know that a lot of people, they are uh, struggling with these kind of problems. So I have been there and I uh, absolutely understand you too, if you are experiencing uh, so the same situation as I experienced. Uh, so let's move what I do. I, I told it already. So my... Uh, uh, core values of uh, of of my uh, business uh, are so I'm like I'm provide online education, uh, business, and NLP coaching. So to the people with a huge mission and who are aware of their transformation or that they have to go through a transformation of their mindset to educate themselves to can change the life of another people and of themselves. Um, <clears throat> I have created as well uh, a membership e-learning platform for uh, my audience who, who wants to to transform uh, their mindset because it's about leadership and everything starts by yourself. Uh, before you start to transform the life of another people, you have to transform your own mindset and to educate yourself, yeah, to go through the transformation. And uh, the um, I have shared with you here the link of my website, uh, businesspoweracademy.net. Outside this all, I'm a global networker. So I truly love the people. I truly love to guide and coach the people and to network. So it's a huge passion of me to network. So around the world with people from different countries. Because of that, I have a truly a very, very um, a wide network uh, in, in different countries of the world. And so I have created a global live forum where we meet with infopreneurs from all the world and transform the life of another people through our life story and a life experience. So we share, we share our life story experiences, our failures, but as well our achievements, because when it's a part of the mindset that you need so to master you have to to share your failures to learn from there and to move forward to can grow <clears throat> and so the webinars details uh, <clears throat> only only the webinar so it it takes about approximately 90 minutes. It's not always 90 minutes. It could be much more, but without guests, yeah? So including the, the guests, it's plus uh, one or and a half hour more. And the strategy of this webinar is uh, sharing your life story and implementing your life story. So to design, uh, your uh, first online course or or uh, your coaching package. 
uh, I'm here to, uh, to answer all your questions. So if you have any question, if you are struggling with something, if you don't have clarity, just don't hesitate to ask me. I'm here for you. So at your service to help you. If you don't have clarity as well, just don't hesitate to, to ask me. I'm going to ask you. Uh, if you have no ties, so during the webinar, I have asked questions. That is very important to create as much possible interaction. So that's the reason why I'm asking you a question uh, uh, at the same time to, uh, to awake you just to, to make you aware of, of your situation, of the changes that you have to go through. And this is not a sales webinar. This is an inspirational, motivational webinar. And when you feel ready to start, then you can start. And in this webinar, I have a special offer uh, for you, which I will tell you more about at the end of this webinar. Now let's go ahead. So product types, I want to, to introduce my product types to, to you uh, and to acknowledge you with the quality so of my services, my coaching and guidance. Uh, through a webinar, so you can generate a lead. So it's a, a generation lead system that will help you <clears throat> um to create massive impact and to attract your best client through your expertise and life story and experience <clears throat> we uh, so and um there are different uh, product types as i called it the lead generation bread and butter product I will tell you so further what is a bread and butter product. And then there are <coughs> modulated courses, a group coaching, modulated courses with a combination of group coaching <coughs> that you can provide through a Facebook groups, um, master mindset classes as well, and one-on-one -on -one coaching. I can imagine that for many of you, uh, this is very challenging. So to discover how many types of, of <clears throat> online coaching you could provide. <clears throat> so I want to drink uh, some water because <clears throat> I lose my voice. I have told a lot today. So let's start with the, the first one or the first type of, of uh, lead generation system machine. <clears throat> and then, it, then Kennedy said always that a buyer is a buyer and it will remain a buyer. So uh, because why? Because when you provide some value that you are uh, sharing something of your product it's uh, by the lead generation you have only to introduce yourself uh, with a, a bread and butter product yeah is there about because uh, to generate leads you have to to give them something to attract them and that's the trick this is truly a marketing trick that that all the companies are using and me too so uh, a trick could be as well a webinar like i'm doing now yeah a trick could be for example um a master mindset session <clears throat> or a, a coaching session as well for free that the people can opt in through your opt-in page and uh, uh, to book a, a coaching session for free yeah, that's a butter uh, and and uh, a bread and butter product. Any product that allows you to generate paid leads, yeah, new leads, for example, prospects for for other products, 
uh, you can generate it through lead generation and through the way that I told you right now. For example, yeah, you can, uh, what I have personally done, I created a mini course for emotional intelligence, which I'm providing through my uh, messenger. I have integrated um, a messenger funnel uh, to attract my client. Uh, uh, and when uh, the client or the, the prospect is opting in, they leave their uh, uh, credentials uh, like name, a surname, and um, phone number, and email address, then they get so my mini emotional intelligence mini course. Uh, I have as well a e-book, but I prefer to generate some passive income so through my uh, e-book, or you could share as well a video to attract your best client or an audio or a mini course, as, as I told you uh, right now. You can sell this type of product directly through a Facebook advertisement or a thank you page when someone has just downloaded your freebie. So the price of this kind of products, so they start from a minimum of five euro until 100 euro, but not more, yeah? because this is about lead generation and to attract your ideal client, you have first of all to show them uh, your, the quality of, of your services, your products or, uh, or guidance or coaching. And you have first of all, through your uh, lead generation uh, product to uh, create a trustable relationship. That's a very, very useful uh, secret that you have to take in consideration. And that's important to don't uh, uh, overprice your product because uh, a lot of people, they cut. So when it comes to pay, because not because you are not good enough at, it's not about how good you are because if the people don't know you, they don't buy from you. And that's the reason why you, you must uh, uh, give them a good price uh, and the opportunity to learn more about you and, and about your expertise and the quality of, of, of your products. Yeah, I think that it makes huge sense. And so I sell my ebook for 10 euro. Um, uh, I want to give you an example of how to generate passive income uh, uh, without uh, knowing this. While you are, for example, uh, on, on vacation, you can publish your um, ebook on Amazon. Uh, <clears throat> I'm, I'm selling my book for 10 euro, why? And because I have already experience, yeah. And so uh, many people denounce me, but in your case, if you are a starter, so it means that uh, you, uh, you have to take in consideration and to work at your uh, branding just to, to promote yourself, yeah. For example, you could offer your book for, uh, five euro or for seven euro or dollars. It depends on which country are you living. And so this is the bread and butter product, uh, which I told you right now. So it's it's your lead magnet to attract your client. And <clears throat> it, uh, it doesn't uh, um, uh, ask a lot of interaction with the people. Uh, the only thing what you have to do is to to give them or to provide them something uh, a, pr a product which is ready that they can download yeah uh, after they leave their their credentials so it it doesn't take uh, a lot of interaction from your side you have only to to give them the opportunity that they can download your product and that's all and that's the way how you uh, build up a relationship with your uh, ideal client with with the leads as well yeah uh, this could be an online course uh, uh, 
to get ac immediate access to the course or a ebook or a video as well yeah for example i as i told you i'm providing so this mini course uh, which consists uh two videos uh an introduction video before they opt in and uh, or when they want to opt in and uh, when they opted in already is a video is a part of the course where i'm telling about emotional intelligence so you have to understand as well the structure of the course and how to create the course yeah and the price for the the bread and butter product must be accessible as i said it already why um how higher the value is how higher the price is yes so you have to be aware of the value that you are providing so to the people and on basis of the value then you can price your product modulated courses uh, this is amazing so um um modulated courses this is an online course where you your students get access to one module per week but it depends on what kind of course you have for example if you have a course for uh for four weeks yeah uh then you have to create four modules it means one module per week and the price depends uh, on the value as well but but you have to pay close attention because you have to take in consideration the value of your product and the normal price range starts from 500 euro yes up to uh, 500 uh sometimes it can it can be up to two thousand euro but you have to provide more values like um, um a, a extra value like a bonus or something also like this or much more more uh, uh information i call this over delivering yeah um to this uh, kind of, of this type of, of online courses, modulated courses, the participants, they have the chance to either hand in questions or they are part of a course forum or a closed group, a Facebook group, for example, yeah, in which they can ask questions and receive help from you as a mentor, coach or a service provider, yeah. <clears throat> Uh, because of that the uh, facebook uh, groups are highly recommended because you have to uh, be accessible and available so for your students <clears throat> if you want to get paid of course and uh, a modulated course is typically around five or ten weeks long uh, so and because of that so then you have to keep in this uh, price range yes from 500 up till 1500 maximal about 2000 euro yeah maximal but you have to provide over delivering and the price of the modulated courses depends on the length so as i said depends on how many modules do you provide so are you offering uh, uh, to the people and the amount of help and guidance so it depends on the value um, as much possible value you you offer as higher the price called rice yeah just uh, remember it or keep it in in, in your mind uh, coaching groups <clears throat> Uh, the coaching groups they involve a, a program with participants who face the same or similar problems and need uh, the same type of help or guide. Uh, coaching and groups are like uh, I'm doing right now through webinars, but coaching in groups it uh, could be as well uh, through Facebook groups. Yeah, or uh, I'm uh, which tools I'm using for webinars, I'm always using uh, Zoom. Why? Because I love to be uh, so in touch with the people that I, I can see the people and that the people can see me. 
Uh, to me personally, that's very, very important. So that's the reason why I prefer so Zoom. Uh, there are many tools that you can use for, for webinars, like webinars uh, softwares uh, and uh, uh, Teams and many other ops. I think ops, yes, I have used two times ops that you can record there. Um, but that's the disadvantage of OPS that there you can go live. You can go share live streamings through OPS. You can only record. And, but if you need only to record, I recommend you so to use OPS for live streamings and these kind of stuff uh, for advanced uh, uh, technologies. I, I recommend highly Zoom. And okay, so uh, it's possible to teach a topic at the, the start of each session through, through a webinar uh, using uh, Zoom like I'm doing right now. What I want to, to tell you uh, so with this is that when you are creating a webinar, you have to determine your topic where uh, um, will you talk do, during your webinar? What about are you gonna talk uh, during your webinar? Like for example, the topic of my webinar is uh, how to integrate your life story and to create uh, online courses and into uh, uh, the <clears throat> under topic of design, the design your life story. So uh, it's hiding my niche. There you discover my niche. People and who is that exactly? So that's people who are struggling with uh, with pain, frustration, and stress. People who have known failures, and that's very very important. Yeah. And so let's move forward. For many people, group coaching is an easy introduction of the program. So to me too, because it's a, a very easy way to promote your, your products, your uh, coaching uh, programs. Just imagine that through a webinar, uh, within two or three hours, you uh, can already um, introduce or uh, promote so your your programs or your uh, services. <clears throat> and so to um, uh, this is an easy uh, introduction so of the programs as as I said uh, and. Um, as no course portal is needed and the, the video are live. So you don't need a, a, a portal because you can use so this uh, powerful uh, uh, tool. You know, the, the last time uh, uh, Zoom uh, has, uh, has a, 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 such a crazy conversion of clients that's incredible. It's like more than I'm, I'm, I will go uh, back. So to the slide where I was talking at the beginning about Zoom. Uh, so they are converting per day, I think more than 300 and something billion clients in one day. Just imagine how powerful is the Zoom uh, to, to can uh, streaming your uh, webinars and your uh, Facebook uh, group coaching session as well. Uh, okay, so let's move forward. Uh, now, and yeah, so the the price range so of the coaching uh, in groups is uh, it starts from about 500 euro up to 2000 i i have uh, a short you hear the minimal yeah the minimum price but it's up to 2000 <clears throat> if for example if you want to price your coaching program or course uh, 
So with 2,000 euro or uh, 1,900, it you have to take in consideration that you have to offer more modulus, like two or four more modulus. The length must be longer so that you provide uh, the right value to the people for the money that they want to invest so in your expertise. And combination courses. So it's a combination of, of courses. And so we are selling these uh, modulated courses for group coaching from 3,500 euro and up to uh, 10,000 euro. I have um, a program which costs about 14,000 euro, but it's a one year program. And in this program, you um, you get uh, every single week you you get a, a, a group uh, session uh, coaching um, where you 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 get the the course, and it uh, de depends uh, as well on on. Uh, um, how deep do you want uh, to, to go? Uh, but uh, I'm uh, every single week uh, online, so uh, through live streaming uh, for, for this course, but for every uh, courses that I have, I'm providing. And so when the price is so high, it means that you have to over deliver you you have to take in consideration that if the people pay to you a lot of money it means that you have to provide a, a lot of value and for example you could integrate all your strategy in a such course uh, a business model, a revenue plan, um, the structure, how to create a course, for example, uh, from the scratch, yeah, like I did, so that um, to teach, for example, uh, the people on the basis of your niche, what problem could you solve? And through your results, you have to deliver results. So, um, through your expertise, then you can deliver results that the people want to achieve. And so this kind of coaching of uh, online uh, combination courses is a combination of weekly or monthly modules. So um, what I prefer to do, I, um, I prefer to provide a monthly uh, modules and then I'm dividing in per week. Like every single week, I'm providing uh, a, uh, a part of, of one module. And so in, in this uh, type of, of combination courses, all the participants get uh, an outline of the course and guidance through regular live videos and QAs, like, like I said it already, so that every single week I'm there uh, uh, live. So I'm streaming the, the live videos. Uh, and then uh, at once I have uh, the possibility to provide as much possible of value to the people. So, and I love uh, much more this kind of uh, coaching. Uh, why? Because um, I, I save a lot of time. So first of all, uh, and then I can uh, share so my knowledge uh, with, with many people at, uh, at once. Like uh, at once I called, uh, um, a mentor, for example, uh, 100 people. And that's amazing, that's awesome. So it means that you save time and you generate your income. So in, in, in a short time, uh, by sharing uh, your expertise and values. Um, so what uh, is including this uh, type of combination courses, often the course includes individual assistance or support, so it can be organized as well through one-on-one -on -one call before, during uh, or after the program. Um, 
uh, this example is, for example, when you uh, are giving a webinar through a live streaming, uh, like me now, um, you offer the opportunity to the people to opt in and to register for a, a free coaching session, a one on one with you. And you can uh, use that as a butter, uh, uh, a bread and butter product, uh, or in uh, with the marketing terms. So uh, we call that a lead magnet. And that's the way how you can catch the, their attention and to attract so your uh, ideal client. Because what what happens when you uh, offer to the client a one-on-one -on -one, uh, uh, free coaching? Um, first of all, you offer so the opportunity to the people to learn uh, more about you. Second, uh, they uh, can see you through through live streaming and to learn more about your knowledge, expertise, and experience, and about the value of your expertise. And when they uh, um, uh, learn more about the value of your expertise then they will start to buy from you. Normally, it's uh, uh, so uh, on the basis from the uh, uh, scientific research. Um, so we know that uh, a prospect, he needs minimal uh, seven time acknowledging or challenging from, from your site before they buy something from you. So it means that uh, seven times you have to, to share value with your prospect or leads before they buy something, yeah? So no one uh, is buying something uh, without knowing the value of your product, service, guidance, guidance or coaching, yeah? And so my programs, so they include pre-recorded videos as well. You know, I love to do that. I love to pre-record uh, my live streamings. Why? Because I'm automizing everything. And through email marketing, then I can uh, sell it uh, just to, to inspire and motivate and, and to, to provide value to the people that they can learn so from me to change their life and the life of another people, of course. And so uh, what, what um, uh, I'm providing as well is technical support. For example, that I'm telling you um, which uh, tools you can uh, use and how to use them, what's the, the most convenient tool uh, based on the price and the quality uh, of course. And then I have um, a team behind all the scenes uh, which helps me uh, to providing this uh, type of values and uh, they help uh, all my clients to, to uh, you know, care uh, all the stuff out because in my own it's impossible to do that. So it's uh, really a lot of stuff. Only for my own coaching company, I barely have free time. Why? Because I'm always busy uh, to, to promote and to provide values. I always have interviews. I always have uh, live streamings, webinars, uh, uh, Google Good motivational Google cast, for example, that uh, I'm, I'm all the time busy. So just to um, grow up and to transform the life of another people. Because all this, what I'm providing you now is for you. So it's to change your life and to help you to grow out. Uh, mastermind, I truly love the mastermind. So it's uh, one of my favorite part, you know, uh, in the coaching. Why? Because it, it, it offers you the opportunity 
to switch from one level where you are to the next one, just to grow from all the point of view. So through master mindset, so you can change everything in your life. So and the functionality, especially of, of your relationship, of, of your own self, so of your uh, mindset, the way who you are dealing with everything, the um, your attitude, your behavior, and everything what you are doing in your life. Um, now let me let me let me tell you more about mastermind uh, uh, classes, and I truly love this. So it's it's uh, my passion. Uh, this is uh, what is a mastermind. Mastermind is an annual program. Mastermind you educational course. So you. Uh, educate yourself through mastermind and this product type often includes a combination of online meetings and physical events as i told it at the beginning of uh, during the introduction of my webinar i truly love that i have been able so to be uh, in front of ten thousand of people in front of five thousand three thousand yeah uh, during the uh, national and international conferences. I forgot only to add a picture, but the next time I will do my best, I will uh, share uh, with you so the picture uh, where uh, it, it is very funny because I'm a woman and um, I remember that I was in a team with only men. How crazy! Men. So how crazy is that? That you, as a woman, so I was very proud. So it's very powerful uh, because I had only men around me, like in 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 my team. Uh, and so this product type often includes a combination of online meetings and physical events, as I said but it's so impressive and it's so impactful the the master mindset classes uh because you you get in touch with people from all over the world so people in different industries because the master mindset what you have to understand is for all kind of industries to can succeed the master mindset it helps you um to switch uh, or, and to change uh, as well your financial situation to create financial freedom and uh, to the master mindset classes uh, are coming people from all the fields literally from from all the industries and that's amazing to see that um mastermind programs so require a strong commitment and high level of engagement from you and from another people who is inter interested so into the uh, master mindset uh, programs and to can care it out for you to can help you out i created um, uh, <clears throat> a global life forum where you uh, I get access for a, a, a low uh, fee uh, on monthly and annual basis. It depends on you. If you want to, to join us for one month, it's possible. And if you don't need that, uh, then okay, you can leave it. But <clears throat> we meet here with people from all over the world, from different countries. And we are sharing so our experience and we grow up together. And that's what you have to realize that through connection uh, and, and sharing your life story so you can grow and you can learn a lot. And uh, uh, such a type master mindset um, class on annual uh, basis uh, can cost approximately from, it starts from about 6,000 euro up the, uh, 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 up to 50,000 euro per year. Yeah. And you know that the people, they are investing uh, in, in the mastermind. Why? Because mastermind is everything. It, it switch up your, your leadership, everything, all the levels where you need to grow in. 
and that's why it's so expensive why because it 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 it's delivering like an incredible value it, it changed everything in your life uh, during the master classes you you get uh, really a lot a lot of of uh, high class information uh, who is which is available only for for leaders so it means that for business owners uh, CEO uh, founders uh, and, and entrepreneurs and infopreneurs. What I want coaching. Ooh, ooh. So um, um, when I started, so with with the coaching, I truly loved to uh, one on one coaching. Why? Uh, because. Um, I was so excited because you know when you are from the scratch from the beginning every single step of the implementation what you are experiencing of your knowledge is uh, it, it, it's very exciting so uh, and that that was that that was me <laughs> in that case um, so it, it was very very interesting to me uh, to guide people one-on-one -on -one and i love people that's the most passion passion what i have and if you want to become a coach you need you have to love the people or if you don't have uh, this uh, mindset then you have to master it because through love, dedication, and devotion and passion, so you will achieve your success. And you will attract as well your ideal client. And one-on-one -on -one coaching, so you can stream as well by Zoom, uh, by different webinars, tools, and you can use that for your references, yeah, on your website or uh, through email marketing as well. Uh, that so to create massive impact and, and uh, to create a trustable relationship with your audience, you have to do that. You have to share your references or some some video references, uh, or um, you can ask a, a client of you to, to write something. If you don't have, here's a, a gold uh, type. So for you, if you don't have yet clients, I recommend you to offer um, coaching sessions for free, and after in in return for for your session, ask uh, references. Yeah, so you provide your coaching for free, but you you ask for the references to can use the references on your website or in your email marketing or wherever uh, and whatever you you use. Um, I know that a lot of people, so they are struggling with to get references, but this is the way how you can you can uh, get references because everyone uh, starts there from the scratch. So everyone um, has uh, walked through through all the steps. So even the you know the most. Uh, popular um, coaches in the world as uh, Tony uh, Robbins, uh, <clears throat> Dean Graziosi, uh, Pedro Adao, he's a new coach, but he's so successful, incredible. Shanda Sumter, uh, many others, but the, these ones are my favorite, my mentors as well. Um, <clears throat> and they started as well from the scratch without knowing where will they uh, be today. Uh, Shanta Sumter especially, she told um, so um, in one of uh, her live uh, Facebook uh, streaming, uh, streamings that um, she didn't knew uh, at the time when she started, when she uh, will be uh, in this time. She couldn't know that she could, she was not aware of the impact that she can create. Just imagine, yeah, how much we are undervaluing uh, our uh, power and that uh, how much we can create massive impact on the on other people. And so I um, 
recommend so uh, most of the time the group coaching is it of hours. Um, I meet people who are offering their coaching through hours. Don't do that, please, because you are wasting your time and it's very exhausting. If you, it's better just to to get a job instead. To that's my personal opinion. Eh? Instead to 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 work on uh, business hours, so it's that, then it's much better to to get a job because it it has the same value. Yeah. Um, it of course you you charge so uh the value of your coaching i understand it but uh, i don't recommend it because it uh, it's uh, not not even for the starters you know uh, um, i recommend to to offer a package and not uh, hours uh, because when you offer a package uh, you can um create and your much more so you can uh, create much more pass, uh, massive impact and you can earn as well much more uh, money because it's there about yeah and you save a lot of time that's very very important because uh, just imagine uh, compare when you have a uh, uh, business coaching one-on-one -on -one, uh, and, and the client pays you on the hour basis and when you have a, a, a group coaching, but uh, uh, so you offer packages. Yeah, th that makes a huge sense. And that's the difference. Accept only people who are willing to really work towards their goals. Why? So you have to be selective uh, and accept to guide and coach people who truly um, uh, uh, now uh, the value or who see the value so of your expertise of your knowledge and and your life experience yeah uh, there is uh, people who are rebels or because of their mindset they don't see your value it's not about you even if you are excellent so in your expertise and you ask yourself what i'm doing wrong oh my gosh no even if you are doing best, your best and uh, you have rebels, so that they are rejecting you. So it's because of their mindset. Yeah, remember it. Just don't, don't get frustrated about that. And so uh, my clients, so they are selling one-on-one -on -one for 2000. It start a, co a coaching package. So starts from 2000 to uh, 50,000 euro uh, for courses of three or 12 months. Yeah, uh, it's one-on-one -on -one coaching, but as, as I said, it already just create packages, course packages, not hours. And then you, you can charge much more. So for one package, for example, of three months modulus, then you can charge uh, 2,000 euro. It depends on the value because uh, there are um, uh, packages. Uh, I'm uh, selling personally a package that uh, costs about 3,500 euro, um, but I offer 14 weeks uh, modulus, yeah, and much more value, of course. And yeah, so as you see through online uh, coaching, through online courses, you can truly your a lot of money. You can change your own life so you can learn a lot and you can transform the life of another people through education, through educating yourself. Because so you have to be aware that first of all, you have to educate yourself. You have to keep learning and learning. You need a coach, you need a mentor to hire, to uh, guide you through this transformation process. What are the advantages of online courses? Mm. Especially in this pandemic time, uh, because a lot of people, they lose their job, so they are frustrated, they, they don't have any income, and they don't know how to move forward, how to generate income. 
to survive because there are people they cannot even survive yeah and so follow up and check in between without any traveling that's one uh, the biggest advantage of online courses you don't have to travel so you don't have to to leave your home um, because you can work from home you need only your devices to be in front of your uh, computer uh, or in front of the camera if you have to record uh, videos or live streamings and and that's all uh, microphones and this kind of stuff yeah and uh, it's easy to to add so and uh, you can use as well um, in the uh, online courses the reflections between modules i do it as well i have integrated in all my courses uh, the uh, evaluation uh, uh, template and after each week uh, so I'm evaluating the results of uh, of the students so we reflect on uh, all the stuff that we uh, that the my students have learned during one week um yeah so as i said so you save more uh, time you you create as well so more free time for yourself and for your family and it offers you the opportunity uh, uh, to the students to study from home as well so how awesome is that not only you but your students as well so they can learn from home and another uh, huge advantage of the online courses uh, is that you can watch the pre-records whenever you want. So uh, uh, even if you are outside of, of your home, you can uh, uh, watch so the pre-records on your phone as well. Yeah. So how how comfortable is that? Uh, I am someone who is always angry for information, so and that's the reason what even if I'm uh, on the way somewhere, so I'm always watching on my my uh, uh, mobile phone the pre-records or live streamings or webinars. And so uh, another advantage is that you create the product together with the client, so uh, no production beforehand. It means that uh, based on the uh, field or industry of, of your client, you create the product together. So you um, can uh, guide uh, the student through the process and to, to teach them how to, to create that. And so um, our recommendations. As I mentioned it, personally, personally, I prefer so the uh, group coaching, and I mentioned already the reasons that uh, you know you you can generate really a lot of income through through the group coaching, and and outside that outside that you save uh, a lot of time. And you create more free time and more freedom because through group coaching, at once you can generate, for example, the income for one or two months ahead. Of course, if you are doing your best, because you have to deliver to over deliver value, yeah, as much possible informations and, and information and tools, uh, an ebook, mini course, and whatever it could be, yeah and what uh, this is my own strategy and approach for, 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 for so for my coaching and for my students to choose a business model which works for you so this is uh, belongs as well to the uh, group coaching because this kind of business model generating the home that uh, offers you the opportunity to create the the lifestyle you truly want uh, from the depth of your heart so financial freedom how awesome is that and 
uh, probably now you don't even realize how powerful is the group coaching and how much could you learn, but it's truly impressive. Because in only one year, so you have the possibility to earn about 1 million euro. But if you keep to create consistency, yeah. And um, I have here an example, yeah. I think this is important to, to let you understand how does it works, how does it works a business model. As you see here, I have um, if, for example, uh, when you sell uh, cheap courses and you want to generate uh, about 10,000 euro in, in a month, um, uh, just imagine that you have a course of 400 euro, yeah? You have to sell approximately uh, 24 courses in one month to generate 10,000 euro. So it means that you need 24 clients approximately yet to generate this income in one month. Uh, instead, if you uh, uh, will uh, use uh, the group coaching then to generate the same the same income, yeah, uh, and you get a high uh, 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 paid uh, Ticket the clients, you need to sell only two or three packages. Just you, you see the difference. So there is huge, very huge, huge difference because um, the uh, small uh, courses and, and the cheap one, they, they require more time and more energy. So it means that you have to to invest more time there and 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 the the income is not so high so you have probably to uh, invest uh, five or six times more uh, uh, time so uh, here and instead if you um, uh, get high paying clients for your package and you deliver, for example, or you sell only three, four or two packages and you generate already. So your desired monthly income. And so thanks to, to this business model uh, for high uh, paying ticket clients, you save more time and create more financial freedom. So let's move forward ways to sell your products um yeah i i have been told already uh, about this that through email marketing you can uh, sell uh for example the pre-records of your webinar or your live streaming um like i'm doing right now because i'm recording this uh, webinar and then i can sell it uh, through a uh, video sales letters so it means that um, if you have an email list then you can uh, send you um, this uh, this uh, pre-recording to your clients and they, they will buy it from you and another uh, type of of uh, to, to selling your products are the email campaigns uh, i don't know if you know but if you don't know, uh, then I want to, to share with you this, that before the people buy something uh, uh, from you, so you need to create an um, email campaign of, of seven uh, emails. Yeah, that's the structure of an email campaign. Uh, so you you have to to send them a reminder as well because so many people uh, they have a, a full uh, box of emails and sometimes they can cannot see that because there are too much and uh, many times uh, they are canceling so a lot of emails and there is the probability that they, they uh, don't see your email so because of that you have to send a reminder yeah 
And what is interesting that uh, with the worm acquisition, it means that with the existing clients, you, you can do upselling. So it means that to the same client, you can rise up your uh, price for your product and to sell. So for a, for a higher price to the same client. And because you have already uh, built up a relationship with your client, then they pay uh, you, you the price you, you want because they trust you because they are acknowledged with the value of your product or service, yeah? And so another way to, to sell your products or services are the webinars. And that's what I'm doing right now, yeah? So through my webinars, I'm promoting my products, uh, and my, my coaching. Uh, and so at the end of this webinar, then I'm gonna, gonna provide the offer. And the webinar is the quickest way to provide so uh, uh, your your service to offer your service and to promote your, uh, the quality of your product. And cold acquisition. So because I have a lot of experience in sales, uh, I have integrated so in my strategy uh, some examples just to share with you cold and a warm acquisition. So uh, people who is uh, familiar with uh, recruiting, then uh, especially sales people, they know that cold acquisition um, are the people who, who don't know you yet. And through webinars, so you can um, acquire cold acquisition uh, that you don't need even a opt-in page because uh, watching your webinar, people uh, uh, can apply so for for your products or service through a, a link, a um, call to action. I I call I named it call to action where they uh, will be leaded so to your uh, services or products. And warm acquisition, so is warm acquisition are the clients who already know you, who already are your clients. That's so you can do upselling in this case. So because they know you and it's much easier to sell a product to a client who knows you instead to a client who don't know you. Uh, wh what I truly like because so I have uh, worked into network marketing and communication. Uh, we had a team there uh, of thousands of people because we uh, have, have collaborated so with many countries in the world, about 25 countries in the world. We had a lot of, of agents, so we were like a kind of agents because we had teams and we must uh, coach the teams. Um, and then when you integrate sales agents in your business coaching or coaching industry, um, it will make it easier for you uh, to, to create your financial compensation plan to generate income. Uh, why? Because this is another uh, income streaming uh, um, so we have passive and active, or active and passive uh, in, income streamings. And in this case, this is an active uh, income streaming uh, where you can generate through sales agents that you can hire so for your company. Or students, you know, there are students that they are looking for a job and uh, you can uh, pay them out on a percent basis. Yeah, that uh, on the basis of, of the product selling, you can uh, pay them out, so a, a, a percent. Okay, I think that it makes huge sense because uh, this information, um, from this information, you can learn a lot. Uh, video sales letter. Hmm, this is very, very beautiful because through the video sales letter, you can generate a lot of income. 
uh, video sales letter is the easiest and the best way to sell products that cost up to 400 euro yeah so these are uh, many products not not too uh, too expensive you take in consideration that through a video sales letter you can uh, sell this kind of products uh, so you invite your prospects to watch a video like I'm doing right now, uh, where you teach something for five or 12 minutes. Uh, the disadvantage of a video sales letter is that you can uh, not share a webinar. Um, you can share just a, a mini course. That's what uh, but I think that this is an advantage because you don't have to invest uh, a lot amount of time. Um, it's it's the uh, uh, quickest way just to, to generate uh, passive income because if you have pre-records and you out, can automate that, so you create passive income uh, through, um, through the video sales letter. Uh, offer something what will trigger the interest so of your audience that they will buy right now from you something that they truly need so you know you if you will offer something that they are not interested in they will never buy from you so you have to know what do they need what do they need so to to solve the problem or to pinpoint their pain and so case study sales letter one of uh, my clients was selling a physical course for 199 euro so peter eric for example helped uh, here to fill the course from facebook ads and then he told so to to this client to create an online course and she set up a video sales letter where she spent five minutes discussing great tips about her topic. Uh, five minutes selling uh, her course for, for 99 years, then you can imagine five, you spent only five minutes uh, to create a video and you can earn 99 euro. And then don't forget to, to add a spot with a limited offer. So it means that you have to uh, add that uh, this offer is limited and that they are uh, limited available spots uh, and this is uh, just to to trigger the interest of the people and to uh, to let them buy from you and so this lady she used facebook uh, to promote uh, her video in the end and uh, she sold 175 courses just imagine huh? and uh, this is passive income it's not even active because it's automated active is when you are there live and where when you you are teaching uh, properly the people you know and uh, you are showing up but this is automation so i mean uh, through uh, then just imagine what what is the the power of the online courses through automation so this lady generated about 70,225 euro in only three weeks. So how freaking amazing is that? Three weeks, 17,225 euro, only spending five minutes. So for your video, a selling course, yeah. So I think it's 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 amazing just to create a a, a such a mini course and and to sell it. So and it goes through video sales letter. Yeah, remember that. Email campaigns. I love emails campaigns because it's like a magnet. So because of that, we uh, use the term uh, lead magnet in marketing. And email campaigns can be used for products up to 400 euro. Um, an email campaign should run for a strictly limited time of two or, or uh, four days. 
uh, and it works uh, well. So it means that if you have a, an email campaign, for example, for a program, so it will take two, four days. But specific for, for these types of courses, pro products up to 400 euro or until 400 euro, yeah? Uh, so you have to send an email per day for the first one, three days. On the last day, you send three, four emails. It's like a reminder, yeah? And as well, don't forget to add the uh, uh, limited spot, yeah? And the call to action, just to motivate the people to buy the products from you. Uh, it's so uh, we call a de de deadline uh, here and the call to action and Wallace test out the quality of the email campaigns based on the results. So just take, take a look at the conversion. How much do you sell so through your email campaigns? This is all uh, this is necessary to do to increase the conversion so of your prospects and, and, and sales yeah so because of that so you have to pay close attention at the quality of your email campaigns so you have to use the right uh, communication to trigger the interests of your prospects uh, case study email campaigns so one of of my clients here um I speak about email campaigns and she decided to write an email campaign and she sold so for two, uh, 20, uh, 2,000 euro in four days. Just imagine how powerful is uh, uh, email list and the email campaigns. So it, it, it makes uh, wonders uh, if you have an email list. A tip to, to create an email list is when you keep in touch with people uh, who you are coaching or who you want to help, just ask them for an email address. And, and ju just you, you have to collect uh, the email address if you are from the scratch. Uh, if not, then I recommend to use landing pages. Um, uh, and the mini courses uh, where you have to uh, use the advertising and through advertising webinars, then you can uh, generate much more uh, email uh, addresses, yeah. A webinar, so let's talk uh, more deeply about webinars. And so uh, how to create a webinar and uh, especially when it, it came uh, about the information, what kind of information you have to integrate. So in the structure of a webinar, um, if you have noticed uh, um, before I start, I introduce myself or if I have a guest, so I'm introducing the guests uh, from the beginning and then I introduce myself too. And then I, uh, I share, after that, I share my life story, my life experience. That's of the utmost importance to share your life experience, your life story. So with the people, why? Because you have to, or you need to create a trustable relationship with the people. When they learn more about you, they can trust you. They can see your, your vulnerability, your sensitivity, or the power of your personality of, or your expertise and life experience. Yeah? And then after uh, sharing your, your uh, storytelling, your life story, you have to introduce the right content of, of your expertise. So uh, you have to share uh, uh, the um, services, products, uh, what are the benefits, uh, for who uh, are your products, uh, how are you gonna help the people and then 
uh, don't don't forget to show them the call to action. How can they keep in touch with you? Through which platform or a, or a link or uh, whatever it it could be. And then so. Um, at, uh, at the end so of the content, you have to, to integrate the offer. Uh, the offer of your webinar. So what do you want to, to provide them, to, to sell them? And so during uh, 10 and 20 uh, uh, minutes, uh, uh, when you are doing the introduction, uh, so um, you have to, to create engagement, just ask questions and give the opportunity to the people or ask them to write below in the chat to ask you as well questions. And to the opposite, you too, just to make it interactive, ask them something, if they need something, if they hear you, uh, if they have uh, any questions, Everything what could be just then just um, take the accountability and create engagement. Uh, uh, normally, a webinar so it, it can take from thirty until ninety minutes, but because I love networking, so I'm always using the strategy of guests. So I love to inspire and to motivate people through another life stories of another people. And so uh, uh, during the, the webinar, when you share so your content of your products or services or coaching, um, you have to offer a solution to your audience. So offer them a solution so that they can solve their problem, that they can achieve results. And so the, the offer is the call to action. For the people who don't know what is a call to action, just um, remember it that your call to action is, is your, uh, your offer your product or service and don't forget to add the limited time. For example, if you offer your product or an offer uh, that you say, uh, if you uh, register now, uh, so you uh, get my offer for only 2000 euro, yeah? And if, if you pay at once, if you uh, will enroll, uh, within three or four days, and then so you get a, a higher price, for example, to a half thousand euro, yeah? And then um, let uh, your audience know that the time is limited so that they have, for example, only three or four days to enroll to your program. And that's how it works. It, it, uh, it uh, makes a very powerful impact and engagement, first of all. How can you use webinars? So you can use webinars to sell automated webinars courses, a modulated courses that cost between 500 and 2,000 euro, as I told you previously. Now for this uh, price range, you can sell directly. So on the webinar, but sending your audience to your sales page. So where they can sign up and for your coaching program. Um, so you have to, to share a link of your sales page of your product or service or one-on-one -on -one coaching session uh, or a package. Uh, and where so you share the link of, of that page to, to the people during the webinar at the end of the webinar. Yeah. And it's also possible to use the webinar to sell a, a free call, as I said it already, where you sell more expensive products on, on, on the call basis. Yeah. Because when you uh, have people on the call, uh, then you you can charge much more than in a webinar. 
Why? Because, because it's individual approach. You can provide them much more attention uh, and, and you can share much more value. And that's, that's the reason why you can charge uh, much more money. Uh, sales calls. Oh, I love this. Uh, uh, sales calls, especially in this pandemic time, you can use Zoom. Uh, I love to see the faces of the people because uh, during a sales call, you have to ask questions. And this is a very important trick that you can use because I know that a lot of people, they are afraid of, because of these sales, because they don't know the approach, uh, what to say, how to say, uh, and how to in, uh, engage people so in, in, in to buy their product. Products that cost from uh, 2,000 euro or more are best sold using individual uh, sales calls, yeah? But it's uh, like uh, I'm doing right now that you can see me, I can see you, I can see your 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 face, and uh, it uh, so when when you uh, charge uh, up to two thousand euro, you uh, need uh, to pay close attention or much more attention to your buyer, to your prospect. You have to provide much more value. Um, because so they uh, want to pay you, of course, a lot of money. And give your audience the possibility to, to book a call with you and answer a questionnaire beforehand. So, you know, it helps a lot for engagement, to create engagement when you are doing this, when you are using um, uh, this, when you offer the possibility to the people for a book call, to book a call so with you and to answer a questionnaire beforehand. What I have done, uh, I have um, as well integrated on my website a quiz list questions when you can uh, answer all the questions before so uh, you can start with or book with me a call session. Uh, what I recommend, I recommend all the time to use um, a sales script during a call. Why? Because uh, many people, most of the people, when they are from the scratch and they want to be helped, but they don't know how and what exactly, uh, through the uh, questions, you, you give them clarity and to build trust. Um, what you have to take in consideration is to build up an um, intimate relationship with your prospect. What I mean with an intimate uh, relationship is when you uh, ask uh, questions about what doesn't work in your life at that moment. What works, what if it works, uh, how? Did they do that? And if it doesn't work, what is the reason that they didn't achieve that? And from there, then you can pinpoint the pain. You can find out the problem of your prospect. And then from there, you can help uh, him or her out to solve the problem. Yeah. And what I recommend as well uh, to use the uh, goal settings. So if you will use the Google sec settings during a sales call, it's powerful because you will analyze so uh, the situation of the Google settings of your prospect and to have a look at uh, and, uh, here or his achievement. And you can get as uh, well a, a call booking from webinars directly from ads and from email campaigns. So this is another way to, to generate uh, leads and prospects and to, to generate financial freedom. And so you have, for example, to pre-record uh, a uh, webinar uh, and uh, through the pre-recording, you can automate that. 
uh, and uh, offer uh, your webinar directly from the advertising uh, and through email campaigns. So uh, I think that it makes uh, sense because it will help you to, to get more clarity about the sales. And so how can I help you? Or I, I said here we because we together with my team because all the stuff I'm not doing in my own. So I have people who helps me. And so with my team together, we will show you the strategy and the approach that, that I'm using for my personal uh, growth and, and financial freedom. And I'm going to show you how can you skyrocket your business to the next level. Uh, who is this for? So this is for you if you are stronger than your excuses. So, you know, we people, we are uh, used to, to use so many excuses only to don't take action. Uh, but it, it concerns your mental blocks if you are doing uh, this, if you are holding yourself back. And I recommend to pay close attention at your thoughts, at your feelings as well. And why do you feel like that? If you feel stuck and you are not, not uh, happy with your life, just play, pay close attention yeah, at, at your feelings, at your emotions. How do you feel? Why do you feel like that? So just leave the excuses, leave your comfort zone and get ready to take action and to change your life right now. Why now? Because you need so money, you need to your money, you need to transform your life and the life of another people. And so if you are committed, uh, this uh, webinar is as well for you if you are truly committed. If you have made a commitment to succeed and uh, to uh, fulfill your purpose and and uh, to to bring out your mission so to your audience to transform their life to sell your knowledge and experience online um, this webinar is as well for you if you want to transform your own life and and the life of another people how can you transform your own life i can imagine that most of you have this question you can transform your life transforming the life of another people providing them the right solution to solve their problem to create massive impact in the world and if you want to create a profitable business and achieve success, so you need a mentor, you need a coach, because if you don't invest in yourself, in your own education, that you cannot deliver nothing. That's, that, that's what you have to be aware of. If you didn't invest in yourself, you cannot deliver. So you need to learn, you need to acquire the knowledge yeah because without knowledge you cannot earn money you cannot transform your life so it means that you have to make it possible just to to take accountability and to create that to create the life of your dreams uh, so the call is 100 percent free so this webinar is absolutely for free just imagine how much can you learn during a such webinar and write ooh, ooh, in the chat if you would like a free call just let me know if you are interested to create your own program so just jump in and go for it why are we offering this so during our private call uh, you get a call with me personally so i'm gonna help you gain clarity on which products should you sell and create first of all so based on your passion life experience and knowledge i'm gonna show you how to create an online course or, or online program that you can sell and what price and the strategy 
to generate sales yeah if you want to work closer with us with me and my team and we think that we are a good fit then i invite you to join one of my online programs uh, i want to share with you three tips not three tips because yeah three tips for uh, succeeding so and how many times have you said next tomorrow later <laughs> just think seriously about this me too i did it too uh you know and then at the end i i felt so so much frustration so much pain and then i thought oh my gosh if i did it if i did it but i didn't at that time the right things and <clears throat> I, I I truly recognize myself uh, in that because before, so I did it too. So I was procrastinating and I I was postponing, you know, and then I, I say tomorrow, later, tomorrow, or the next time. No. It 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 when it came to take a decision, just take a decision and change your life. Think about the value of in what are you investing and what could it provide to you that's what you you have to be aware uh, about about the value and about what can uh, do this program with you with your life how radically could change your life if you invest in yourself how many thousands of 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 your old dollars have you invested in in things that you you didn't achieve something and i'm sorry that you did it because i did it too i i spent a lot of money without sense like that it it it, it didn't make sense because so like uh i invited as well um uh, money in something that it, it was useless like la, the, so and that's what I mean instead to invest money in useless things I recommend you to invest in your education and to learn and to change your life and so my tips for, for today for you are work consistently at your mindset mindset guys is everything believe me I uh went through this transformation and <clears throat> when i realized how how deeply so i i was undermining the mindset sessions and classes you have to do that you have to work at your own transformation and i will also recommend you to hire a coach or a mentor and um, because a coach provides you a concrete strategy and step-by-step -step a proven approach that will save you a lot of money and frustration and time you don't need no sales investments you know and, and to lose time and energy a proven approach and strategy step-by-step -step, step guidance it's what you need i think yeah which will uh, give you clarity and which will uh, change your financial situation. And what I highly recommend is to participate to challenges and webinars to improve your communication and to uh, skyrocket your business. Why you have to improve your communication? Even if you are not a native English speaker, don't don't mind about that mind better about how to improve that how to work at that and you can do that by using the language by uh, being in 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 touch with another people uh, participate at at, at uh, communities uh, engage yourself so interact with the people to improve your communication and then you will notice that unconsciously your uh, language your, your, your will will improve i did it too so i'm not a, a native uh, english speaker so that i keep learning every single day uh, what will happen when we will work together 
So we will guide you through one of our programs and which will help you to build a funnel to sell your online products consistently. Uh, so our strategy is proven or my strategy is proven and our approach gives you guarantee. So it means that through my strategy, through my program, you get the guarantee that you will get results. Why? Because it's a proven guarantee. So it's something that it, it, it's already proven that it, it works. So this is my uh, webinar for today. If you have uh, questions, uh, ask. don't hesitate to ask me, please, uh, below. So in the comments, comment. Uh, I want to offer prizes as well. If you engage with me, if you will join and uh, register so for, for my program, this is the first day of my webinar challenge. And tomorrow, then I will you acknowledge with the prizes of, of the webinar. What could you win during this webinar if you engage? So just um, be as much possible active. So in the comments, um, Tomorrow, I will ask you to, to engage with another three entrepreneurs or infopreneurs to, to watch uh, three videos of them uh, and to, to be qualified for, for a prize, to win a prize. Tomorrow, then, I will you acknowledge what kind of prizes could you win. Uh, by now, I want to thank you uh, from the deep of my heart. Take care of you, of your uh, family members, and I see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. It was a pleasure to be here uh, with you. Okay.